guys welcome back to my channel my name is PJ if you're new here in today's hair video I will be showing you how to install this V part wig this hair is from Ali Pearl hair it's 20 inches and I did dye it jet black so this is what the hair looks like right out of the package look how nice and full this hair looks all the way down to the ends it was so pretty I really didn't even want to wash it before I put it on the wig comes with five clips and two combs and two elastic bands at the bottom so you can tighten it. So this is what my hair looks like before the wig. I just went ahead and washed and dyed it. I didn't do nothing else to it. And then I'm sectioning out my part for the leave out. So after I sectioned off the center of my leave out, I just kind of combed the rest of my hair to the back. If you have longer hair, you definitely should make anchor braids going around your leave out. But because my hair is so short, the braids will probably unravel. And the wig was still pretty secure for me anyways, but braids will give you that extra security that you're looking for. So I just went ahead and unsnapped all the combs at the top of the wig and just lined the wig up properly before I went ahead and start snapping them down. This wig is so easy and convenient to wear. This is definitely considered as one of my most reliable units. I don't have to worry about any lace. I can just put it on and it's so convenient considering that I am trying to grow back out my hair. So this can be used as a protective style. And I'm one of those people who hate sleeping in wigs. I cannot keep a wig on past a full 24, 48 hours, to be honest. So the fact that I can take this off at night is perfect. So this is what the top of my hair looks like after I snapped it down. I tried to get it close as possible to my leave out, but this is the best that I could do. So I went ahead and added a few loose body wave curls to it. When I tell you this hair is so beautiful in person and it looked even better considering that I dyed it jet black because jet black hair always looks good no matter what. But yeah, it curled nicely. It was so soft and pretty. It still had like a nice shine to it without me adding anything to it. And if you are interested, the curling irons that I'm using, I got these from Target. If I can find a link, I'll make sure that I list it down below. And I'll also will make sure that I list the hair down below as well.
So yeah, I know y'all thinking the same thing I was thinking. As I was flat ironing my hair, I just knew my little hair was not about to cover up this wig. I just knew it. I'm like, what am I doing? But I trusted the process and in the end, it turned out so nicely. I was very surprised because I just knew that it was not going to work, but I made it happen. So you gonna see, just keep watching. Like, look how well that blended. I was shook. I was like, okay, okay. This definitely will be one of my most worn wigs. Out of all the wigs I have, I will definitely be wearing this one. Like, if I had somebody to layer this wig for me properly, you definitely wouldn't be able to tell. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love everybody that supports my channel. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next one.